Hello there! Do you want to learn how to use real-time subscriptions with PocketBase and SvelteKit? In this video, you will learn exactly that. For this, we will extend our previous application, the Expense Tracker, with real-time data. For that, we will extend our fetching logic with real-time subscriptions to update our data. So, let's dive right in. For real-time subscriptions, we will need to use a hybrid pocket-based setup. On the one side, we have the SSR pocket-based instance, which we will still use for the initial data fetching, and then a client-side pocket-based instance, which we will use for the real-time subscriptions, which change our initial data when a change is detected. To set up the client instance, we first need to update our .env file with another environment variable, a public pb URL. Additionally, we will update our source hooks.server.ts file to make the cookie also available in the front end. We need to do that so that we can sync the SSR off section with the one on the client side. For this to work, we will update the export to cookie call. And with that, we already have the foundation down. Next, we will create a client instance and the real-time subscription. For that, we will open source, routes, app, dashboard, page.svelte and create both inside an on-mount call. The subscription will need to have a topic, which in our case is specified with a star and thus it listens to all events. Inside the subscription, we have a callback in which we can work with the data. We will update our available data based on the event. In case of create, we will append the new expense. In case of update, we will update an expense and on delete, we will remove one. Finally, we will also expand the category of expense record so that we can display the category icon. When the page is closed or destroyed, we will also close the client connection. To see if the real-time subscription in SvelteKit works, we have to go to our pocket-based dashboard and edit, create or delete an expense. We then should automatically see updates in the application dashboard as well. Next, we will also add a pie chart inside of our dashboard. We will use the in real time updated data, bring them in the correct format and then display them inside of the pie chart. For the chart, we will use chart.js and svelte-chart.js. Next, we will create a new component inside of source, lib, components, pyshard.svelte. In the component, we first configure the chart and create a prop to submit the data. Inside of the HTML, we then create a chart.js pie. Next, we use it inside of source routes app dashboard page.svelte by first formatting the data correctly and then using the pie chart inside of the HTML section. And with that, we have both the list view and a pie chart with real time updates. This is maybe not the best use case for real-time subscriptions as currently the application is dependent on one user. It would work a lot better if the application would support something like sharing the expenses with a group, in which case we would want to see that everyone sees the expenses at the same time with live updates. We will not build this here yet, maybe at some point, but with this you have the foundation down and you should be able to build something like that yourself. So with that, we learned how to use the real-time subscriptions offered by PocketBase inside of SvelteKit. 
I hope you like this video and you like the course so far. If you have any questions, as always, feel free to ask them in the comments. And if you want to see the current state of the application inside of GitHub, there is a link to that in the description. Thank you so much for watching. And if you liked it, please give the video a like and subscribe to my channel. And see you in the next one. Bye.